Hey guys, it's Jessica Bowser Nelson, and I just finished my workout, so I thought this was a good time, but I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about one of my favorite topics, and that is your language. And I wanna talk a little bit about non-serving language. So too often in life, I really feel like we just constantly use non-serving language, and if your thoughts can actually dictate where you go, then we're kind of self-sabotaging ourselves. So let me give you an example of how, you know, your thoughts actually can straight dictate your life. You know, when I wake up in the morning, I go into the bathroom and my conversation can go one of two ways. It can be, you know, I look in the mirror, kind of do one of these, like, like, oh my God, another gray hair. Like, I'm so wrinkly. I look so tired, probably because I am tired. I slept horrible. You know, oh my gosh, I'm getting so fat. Like, what happened? I shouldn't have eaten that pizza. Man, you know, just such a disappointment. You know, and I just want to go crawl back in my bed and forget about the day. Now, the next day, I could wake up in a totally different manner. I could look in the mirror and I could be like, man, you know, I might be tired, but I'm so thankful that I have a place to sleep at night. And I'm excited about this day and I can't wait to see, you know, what kind of people I come across and who I'm able to help and, you know, whose day I might be able to brighten and I'm ready and I'm excited and I just can't wait to see what's in store and I'm thankful and grateful for all that I have. Now what happens? On those two different days, I have two completely different days because I set the pace for myself. So think about it, what are you doing for your day? Are you helping it? Are you pushing it forward to where you really wanna go in life? Are you setting the track for success? and for awesome things to happen to you? Or are you literally starting out your day with a pity party and with the woe is me and with the this life sucks and when am I gonna catch a break and nothing ever works out for me? And like I said, I know, I don't know about you, but on those two days, I feel two, like two totally different people. So I just wanna challenge you. Set the pace for your life and make it a good pace because if you're dictating your life, then guess who you could be mad at when you're having a bad day? Yourself, that's it. So think about it. Throw out the non-serving language because it's not gonna take you where you wanna go. And if you aren't where you wanna be, consider focusing and really honing in on what you're saying in your thoughts, in your head, or even out loud. You know, there's always that person that you get around that you're like, oh, they just drain the life out of you. Don't be that person. Turn your language around, say something positive, and I guarantee your life will align to it. So hopefully that helped you today. If you are interested in getting some help on getting fit from the inside out, that's what I do. Shoot me an email, jessica at jessicabowsernelson.com, and I'd love to just see how I can help you, you know, meet your goals, fulfill your dreams, and live the life that I know you're capable of. See you guys later.